Hello, and welcome to Date Night with Lulu Bell. I am so happy that you're here to join me, and um, we are here to make memories and have lots of fun. So what we're doing today in this particular video is the chain pull technique, which is, you know, um, there's a little skill that's involved in this. And here is what the deal is with this, okay? So in your kits, if you got a kit from me, you did get some ball chain. And you can cut that chain with a scissor, okay? Um, to different lengths, I gave it a lot of chain so you can, you know, do what you want. But if you wanted to create, let's say, a butterfly wing or something beautiful, you know, with, you know, um, and that's what we're gonna do is kind of a butterfly wing kind of thing today. You're gonna lay down, you know, some paint um, as your base. And then we're gonna have dots of color that we're gonna pull the chain through. If there's too much paint and if you pull too quickly, you will see the chain just gets lost and, and, it, and it just, it, it won't work. So the key is to pull the chain nice and slow, evenly, and not have too much, you know, buildup of paint. You know, when you're putting paint down, you know, you're, we're not putting a lot, you know? Um, so that's just something to keep in mind. Every single thing has a little bit of skills involved. So I want every single person to, you know, um, love what they make. Um, and we're gonna try to avoid every pitfall possible. Um, but that's just something to keep in mind, okay? So what we're gonna do is I am gonna use a black background so that my wing color is gonna be a little bit more prominent. And I'm going to use aquas and purples and magentas in my wing, okay? Um, you can choose to do a white backdrop and any, you can do oranges, reds, you know, whatever colors you want. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to lay down some paint on the canvas. And what, we, you know, when you lay down the paint on the canvas, you want to, you know, have a thin, smooth coating not clumps, you know, of, 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 you know, extra here and there, just, you know, kind of just what it is is so that the paint moves around on it. And, um, you know, on something like this, it just gives it a base. All right. So let's get started and, uh, do our, our, um, angel wing or butterfly wing, um, painting. Talk to you later. Let's get started, shall we? We're going to put a base coat of paint on our canvas. I'm choosing to cover my canvas in black so that there's a real contrast. You can use white, choose aqua for your sky color, whatever you wanna do, but put a thin coat, cover all the white. It's a little difficult sometimes, sometimes, um, you know, a little, uh, canvas will pop up but once we are done we're going to put down the um, ball chain now I gave you a really nice long piece and you can cut that with a scissor and you are just going to simply create kind of like an E and that's going to be your wing and choose what colors you want to do I'm starting with aqua and I have my little tubes here but you have in your kits um, little plastic baggies and you're gonna cut a very, very, very small little bit off the end of the tip to create little dots. And starting, you know, along the, the base of the chain, you're gonna start with your darker color. I started with purple. And you're just gonna start putting little dots of color along the base of the chain and as you add color, you're gonna put the next dot just ahead of the one before it. So you're not putting all of the, the color on one circle that you're just gonna layer, like we have done in other things. You're gonna just kind of, you know, um, keep 
adding a little, you know, a little bit of paint to the next thing right in front. And now we're going to pull. And what happens is you're going to grab both ends of your chain and very, very gently at the exact same time, just slowly, slowly pull the chain through the paint. And what we don't want to do is pull it too fast so that it just gets lost or, you know, gets buried into the black. Or, you know, if you put too much paint, the chain will just go right into the blob of paint. You want to put just enough paint to pull that through. So this was a successful mission, this side. Now we're going to do the same thing and we're going to lay that chain out and kind of like a figure three. And you're just going to go along and you're going to put dots of your darker color and put purple. And then we're going to do aqua right before the purple dot. And now right ahead of that is the green. See, so we're layering the colors and going, and you can see each color. Now we've got a little bit of gold. Some gorgeous blue. This is like a periwinkle. So a nice dark. Some magenta is going to really pop all those colors. Purple again. Now we're ready to pull. So we're going again to take both ends very carefully and the object is to slowly pull them through all of those little things of paint we just did. So slowly dragging the ball chain through all of the paint colors and they meld together and they create the most beautiful, beautiful wing. And you will see when we do a close up, there's all lines of the colors, stunning. And now just to create, let's say a dragonfly body or the little body in the center, you're just gonna do some dots of color. We used purple and aqua. Some of that gorgeous periwinkle. And you're just gonna take your chain and you're just gonna pull it right down, straight down, just to create those lines for the body. And stop. And look at this. That is how amazing that is. That's it. Have some fun. Play with this process.